Hey, hello, my dear class 10th, tending to class 11th students. Welcome to yet another session before your board exams. Right? Yet another session before your board exams. So, alright. I can see a lot of you are here. Lavya, Advait, Raghavan, Puneet. Nice. So, a lot of familiar faces. And you know what? The reason we are doing this session is it's quite simple. Hey, hello, good evening, everyone. <laughs> this is this is one of your favorite sessions, I know. Yes, hello, hey, Aryan, Arpita, Neha, Ria, Yuvraj, nice, Hari Murli. I can see a lot of familiar faces now. It's it's been some time since we have met. Yes, I understand. But uh, you know, uh, the reason for doing these menti sessions is last time when we met, na, uh, you all were saying board is quite far, and you know there is a huge gap in between each paper, which means we tend to slack right we tend to procrastinate and that's why today's session it's not very heavy it's not to demotivate anyone this is a fun kind of session and you know what there are 30 questions so this is a complete physics syllabus menti quiz and menti i understand you have been demanding menti for so long and i have been saying this for a very long time that you know we need animations today it's fun right let's revise 30 easy questions mcq questions and yes, it's Menti. So yes, you'll have all those nice icons and everything. Couldn't understand. Aryan, don't worry. Don't worry. Today you'll revise and I'll also tell you how to go about it. All right. Yeah, yeah Aryan, don't worry. Don't worry. Yes. Hey, good evening. Good evening. Excited? Yes, yes. I'm also excited. Oh, nice. Sampad. Very good. Menti. True love, huh? <laughs> nice. I, I understand. I, I see why you like Menti. Yes, because there is a sense of a game show, right? A conceptual game show. Who is coming first? Who is coming second? Oh my God, I, I answered wrong. Mm -hmm. So these things happen. Yeah, I understand. Bilkul Disha. I, I, you are everywhere, <laughs> if I tell you the truth. And nice, it's good to see you again. Yes. Aranya, hello. Yes, it gives comp. Yes, Advaith, you're right. It gives competitiveness, a healthy competitiveness, if I, if I would say, right? Hello, Priyanka. So, shall we start? Let's see how many of you are here. Uh, nice. Hundred and nine. Okay, eleven. Again, I can see all those funny icons. A ghost. Oh, this ghost looks cute, huh? A frog, banana, <laughs> nice. I'm good, I'm good, IQ. How are you? Thank you, thank you. Oh, you are walking kid, frog. <laughs> this is the reason you like Menti, first of all, I'm telling you, man. Eh? Yeah, Aryan, take in, take in. Don't worry, by the end of this session, I'll tell you. See, focus on the session. Don't don't start panicking because seeing your comment, I see you are panicked. I would say, first of all, just calm down, you know, focus on the session, focus on all the questions. By the end, I'll tell you how to go about it. Fine. Code. Yes. Code is 4286473. You know, it's there on the top. This, this code, huh? 4286473. Yes. <laughs> oh, nice Vaishnavi. So got the code. Is there anyone who is still confused for the code? Guys, 4286473. Yes, Slavia, correct. Ye hota hai. All right. How we use it. Achha, hai. So uh, people go in a new tab on your Chrome and you know what? Go to menti.com. M-E-N-T-I dot C-O-M. Press enter. The moment you enter, it will ask you for a code. Hai na? Code, what code you have to put? 428, 428, 637, and 43. Hai na? Yeah, yes, I'll definitely. This is self-understood here. I'll do it. Are Ashirvat Pushkar. Board acha do bas to. Yeah, code I'm reading again to everyone. 428, 428, 637, 637, and 43. Hai na? 4286, 
योगी रिविजन है सो द क्वेश्चन आर देयर इट इज इट इज गुड फॉर एवरी वन है ना सो जस्ट फोकस ओ नाइस वन नाइनटी नाइन दिस इज द हाइएस्ट रिकॉर्ड इफ आई फील आई मीन इन माई सेशन आई आई नेवर सॉ दिस मच नाइस यशार्थ आई ट्राई All right. So, shall we start? What do you say, everyone? If you are logged in, finally give me a thumbs up. Give me a quick. Just show your confidence. You are ready for board. And you know what? We'll start with the first question. Come on. Five hundred will not go. Five hundred will not go. Yeah. I mean, see if it goes. I don't. I don't have a problem. I'm just saying. Nice. Yatish Yogi Sia is ready. अर्पिता साईराज काव्या स्टार्ट और राइट ओके स्टिल इंक्रीजिंग न्यूमेरिकल्स भी हैं रेडी टू रॉक नाइस वंदना लहाना नाइस ओके रेडी 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 और राइट आई थिंक एंड वी आर जस्ट गोइंग अप एंड डाउन अप एंड डाउन ऑन टू हंड्रेड ट्वेंटी फोर ट्वेंटी फाइव ट्वेंटी सिक्स लेट्स गो गाइज पहला सवाल आपकी स्क्रीन पर Sorry, that's that's my bad. It's a it's a bad version of Amitabh Bachchan, but still, let's start with the first question. All right, the first question on your screen now. Yes, the deal is clear. Answer fast, answer right. You know, fast and right is very important. The first question is. The VI graph of three wires are given to you. Which wire will make the emitter show the minimum reading when connected between points X and Y? So just it's a very simple figure-based question. Nice, Sahil. That's the confidence I'm talking about. Very good. Acha, ha. One more disclaimer to everyone: Don't believe the answers coming in the chat. All right. वायर सी एटी फोर वायर ए हंड्रेड एंड इलेवन मिसक्लिक्स आई एम प्रिटी श्योर दीज आर मिसक्लिक्स और यू हैव बीन हैबिचुअल विद द काइंड ऑफ क्वेश्चन वी हैव बीन डूइंग फॉर सो लॉन्ग दिस वॉज दिस वॉज अ वी आई ग्राफ सी आई अंडरस्टैंड आई हैव आई हैव मेड दिस पॉइंट सो मेनी टाइम्स वी गो फॉर आई वी ग्राफ दिस इज दिस इज द वर्स्ट एग्जामिनर कैन डू राइट हेयर इट वॉज क्वाइट सिंपल इट वॉज अ वी आई ग्राफ राइट सो यू नो राइट The slope of VI graph delta V by delta R is R. So out of C, B, and A, which line has higher slope? Right? <laughs> Push kar yes. Misclick. Yeah, I understand. This question could have been misclick or this small error. You might have thought this is an IV graph. This is a simple VI graph. Higher slope means the line C has higher slope. See, there isn't one easy way of see, uh, seeing a slope, right? one way is you either draw a line and then see this is a lower point higher point and higher point so this line is a higher slope otherwise think of it as a slide you will slide better in this much less i mean you will slide lesser in this and least in this right so this is a higher slope so think like this figure out ways in which you can remember this all right theek hai code hai beta 4286473 all right Yeah, Yogi, that's true. I see, see, uh, guys know this thing a lot. Rise over, right? Nice. <laughs> Low quality. It might be a net issue, right? No matter what, Nidhi, it's okay. Thirty questions are there. Net issue. Just go for the higher quality video, all right? So, wire C has maximum resistance. Hence, the resistance lower. So, higher the resistance, lower the current. See, you are thinking of current. So, V by R will be the current. If R is more. this whole thing will be less so that's why emitter shows minimum reading when wire c is connected so more the resistance least is the current simple right next question yes fine so this was a very easy question very simple question just i'm saying focus hai na be attentive don't be distracted with the chat and everything and everything just focus hai na game hai it's a fun game but distraction nahi aana chahiye just focus on the question It's okay if you take one second more, but try to be correct. All right, come on, let's move towards the next question. Kar Swar, uh, these are concepts which are common in both uh, both the syllabus. Yeah, yeah, Vandana, you can. All right, second question on your screen. Now, 
राइट बिल्कुल लाव्या यू आर करेक्ट आईवी ग्राफ होता तो ऑपोजिट हो जाता यस थैंक यू साहिल विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट इज स्लैश आर करेक्ट अबाउट मैग्नेटिक फील्ड लाइन है ना अ हिंट टू यू इज स्लैश आर फर्स्ट वन से इज और आई वॉन्ट रीड टू जस्ट जस्ट सी गॉरी नाइस दैट्स दैट्स गुड और राइट फर्स्ट वन से इज डायरेक्शन ऑफ मैग्नेटिक फील्ड इन साइड अ बार मैग्नेट ओके नाइस मेजोरिटी इज करेक्ट गुड <laughs> Thank you, Aditya. Majority is correct, and yes, this looks satisfying. Very good. One sixty-eight are correct. I know these small, small ones are a lot of them are misclicks, है ना? Properties of magnetic field lines. See, this is very simple thing. Whenever you think of magnetic field lines, what you have to think first thing is direction inside is from south to north, outside is from north to south, है ना? First thing. Second, they never intersect. Magnetic field lines never intersect. Fine. Third one is they always form closed loop. They always form continuous closed curves, irrespective of the shape of the current carrying conductor. So these three things are important. Never intersect. Inside magnet south to north. Outside magnet north to south. And third one is they always form closed loop. These three points are enough to understand about. I know, Lavya, this might have happened. <laughs> yes. Very good. Aim to. एम तो हायर रहना ही चाहिए आई एम सेइंग एम फॉर द इज अ नाइस सेइंग ना एम फॉर द मून एंड यू विल लैंड अपॉन द स्टार समथिंग लाइक दैट सो द द बेसिक थिंग इज एम हायर राइट यू विल ट्राई दैट मच इवन इफ यू फेल सम वॉट एटलीस्ट यू विल रीच हियर सो दैट्स वाई इट्स अ गुड थिंग ओ कोई बात नहीं नो थॉमस आई एम फ्रॉम यूपी उत्तर प्रदेश राइट हाँ चारवी इट्स अ गुड इट्स अ गुड सजेशन फ्रॉम चारवी Use laptop mouse pad. All right, nice, easy. Prince, if they intersect, na, we might say that there are two directions of a a point, right? Of a charge, there will be two directions, which is not possible. So that's why we say they don't intersect. It's not possible, right? It's the property. ठीक है? अरे अरे अरे. All right, question number three. Shall we move? Come on, right? And you know what? Leaderboard will come after every five questions, right? Which means it will come around six times, not around. It will be six times, all right? Okay. So, chit chat, Vandana. Board, acha de do, yar. Fir chit chat hi karenge. Bad ke. I'm telling you, right? So this, just make us proud, and then we'll sit, we'll chat, we'll enjoy, we'll plan for eleventh, right? That's that's fine. Question number three on your screen now. The VI graph for a conductor at a constant temperature is shown. Guys, look at the language of the question, है ना? At constant temperature is shown to you. Find the current through the conductor when it is connected to eight volt supply. Now, people who are not able to see this image properly, the x-axis is current, y-axis is पोटेंशियल डिफरेंस ठीक करंट में इट इज वन टू थ्री वाई एक्सिस इट इज वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स राइट गौरी इन फ्रॉम बिजनौर आई डोंट इफ यू नो इट इट्स नियर मेरिट एंड पीपल माइंड द आंसर्स इन द चैट लॉट ऑफ टाइम्स आई सी पीपल मिस गाइड इच अदर आई डोंट कंप्लेन आई एम जस्ट सेइंग इट्स ओके रूप Oh, sorry. Your name is Surya, I think. Oh, nice. The majority is correct. Wow, majority wins. Very good. One sixty-six people say option B. That is four amperes. Nice. Very good. My name is Sorab. Naksh. Zoom. See the zoom. See the answer. This zoom in this. The question. The graph said. That you see in current, one is connected with potential difference of two volts, right? So the slope is what? Slope is what you do? Final reading minus initial reading on y-axis upon final reading minus initial reading on the x-axis. So y-axis pe kya ho raha hai? If you take this one, if you take 
2 minus 0 on y axis and 1 minus 0 on x axis and this will be same right thank you Sahil thank you thank you got it got it yes it's okay yes so you can also do any other point it's a straight line no so slope will be same you can also do 3 minus 0 in the x axis right so in the y axis will be 6 minus 0 x will be 3 minus 0 it will always come to in this it's a straight line the slope will be same and right? don't worry about that don't be confused supply voltage is 8 now you have to find current I, what is V equals IR? So I equals V by R. Simple, right? 8 by 2. It is 4 amperes. Electricity. Practice. See, we have given you formula sheets and everything. So there was a session of formula sheets and mind maps. Take uh, take that session and there is a link given. The formula sheets and everything are there. Koi baat nahi. Right? It's easy. Nice, Ishad. So, Simple, easy question, hai na? Theek. Let's see the next question. Question number four. Good evening, Minakshi. Aditya, yes. Definitely. Ayar, for you guys, it will we'll take time. We'll definitely find time to sit with you because we also want to know how you performed in both, right? It won't happen, you'll leave it. We'll come back. Ashwin. Ashwin, Ashwin sir is also there. <laughs> Ram Ram here. Yes. Question number four on your screen now. Now actually, I I'm I have I remember this name, but maybe. Yes, come on, next question. Current I is flowing in a way. Take time and answer this question properly. Right? One, two, three, four. There are four points given to you. You just have to understand Q and R, where it is in, where it is out. Take. Nice. I can see 2 and 3. The third option has a bigger percentage of people, you know, who made this question wrong. But still, majority is still winning. Now, I see in this, it was not just a matter, matter of misclicks. There was a matter of... Thoda bhoat to gadbad hua hai, na? Khalid, Hindi, English chalta hai, yaar. Samjhane ke baari aegi, whenever I have to explain something very deep, I'll go, I'll move to Hindi also, na? Don't worry about that. IP, IPL, dekh rao, are board aane wala hai, yaar. Right? So, come on. The direction of magnetic field due to a straight current carrying wire is given by right hand thumb rule. So that is simple, hai na? Right hand thumb rule. If current is in this direction, you put your thumb towards that direction and curl your fingers to show the magnetic field lines. Current is up and magnetic field lines are like this. Fine. Take care. Yes, yes, right hand thumb rule, na? In the given figure, the magnetic field is directed. Now, in this scenario, if you have a pen in your hand, then fine. Otherwise, just point your hand, point your thumb in the direction of current, like this. And then see, R, it is going inside, Q, it is coming outside. Na na? R pe andar ja raha hai, aur Q pe bahar aa raha hai. Fine. So, that's why. At Q, it is coming out of the screen. R, it is going inside the screen. Na? Options are not coming. This is the explanation slide, uh, Yogi. Q, nahi nahi, Q inside Q hai. Both, both, I, Q, O. Oh, use left hand, ah. Don't do that, alright. Whenever you are trying to find the direction of magnetic field lines because of a current carrying wire, go for right hand thumb rule, hai na? Don't be confused with this. Yes? And that from Q, it is not inside the screen. I is here. See your fingers, no, your fingers are coming out at Q and on R it is going inside, simple, hai na? <laughs> Alright, very good, Kushagra. Mr. Panda, your physics is not weak, you just think it is weak, right? First of all, get this thought out of you that your physics is weak. Fine. So this question also simple, simple application of right hand thumb rule, that's it, hai na? Just revise, revise everything. 
தமிழ் குஞ்சும் குஞ்சும் ரைட் தமிழ் தெரியாது ஸோ எஸ் ஹெல்லோ எஸ் ஆல் ரைட் காக்ஸ் ட்ரூ ஆல்சோ இஃப் யூ இஃப் யூ ரிமெம்பர் காக்ஸ் ட்ரூ இஃப் யூ ஆர் கம்ஃபர்டபிள் வித் காக்ஸ் ட்ரூ ரூல் தென் யூஸ் தேட் பட் யூ நோ வட் ஐ ஸ்டில் பிலீவ் திஸ் மை பர்சனல் தாட் தட் திஸ் ரைட் அண்ட் தம் ரூல் இஸ் பெட்டர் இட்ஸ் ஈஸி டு ரிமெம்பர் காக்ஸ் ட்ரூ மே கேவா தானே ஸ்க்ரூ ஏசே டைட் ஹோத்தா ஏ கேசே டைட் ஹோத்தா ஏ டஸ் இட் டைட் லைக் திஸ் ஆர் லைக் திஸ் ஸோ தேட் கன்ஃபியூஷன் கம் சம்டைம்ஸ் ரைட் ஃபைன் எஸ் ஃபிஃப்த் கொஷன் கைஸ் ஃபிஃப்த் கொஷன் கம் ஆன் அரே நீ திஷா டன்னி கி ஜரூரத் நீ you have i have seen you, you have been revising all the classes don't worry you are prepared menti me don't think misclick ho gaya and these things happen so i am like lagging behind which means i lag behind the boards also that's not like that right enjoy revise make sure that all these see every question is covering small small topics na it's a revision do that right don't take it so hard are question galat ho gaya fun questions chill questions mcq to aane hi nahi hai why are you worrying about it let's revise concepts and and then see which concepts you want to work again so this is the intent of the session right all right bless you to funny rohit all right fifth question on your screen now code is 42863743 on the top you can can see the code na piyush revision ke liye I can cover a lot of small small concepts in this. That's why. So, focus focus. This is a good question. Try try. Come on. Sony, I am repeating code for you. Rest of you solve the question, answer the question. Sony, I am telling the code 4286374. You know, 4286374. I remember the code now. Yes. All right. Two wires of equal length are made of the same material having cross section area 4 and 8. ratio of resistance nikal right we have to find the ratio of yeah gauri right hand thumb rule ooh yes correct i can see there has been error from the majority actually so the d is the correct option this is 2 is to 1 now why this thing happened i am giving you 10 seconds first of all think where you made a mistake then i'll explain don't worry yeah yes you are right 2 is to 1 what mistake did you do lengths are equal area is 4 and 8 right and same material means row is also same na gogri question Yes, Charvi. That's true. This, this only this happened. So resistance control is R equals rho L upon A. So this is how we are revising, guys. Hey, na focus. Sahi hua, galat hua is okay. Forget about it. Now focus. Formula, pata hai? Do you know the formula? R equals rho L upon A. Rho is resistivity. L, uh, L is the length, and A is the area. Length is same given to you. Rho is same given to you. Now can you see that R will be inversely proportional to area? R one upon R two equals A two upon A one. Right? Ah, Vaishnavi. Yes, that's only what what has happened. Yes, so that's why it will be eight by four, not four by eight, and that's why two is two one. Thick, fine, and see, be glad that radius was not given to you. Otherwise, you would have to do that pi r square thing also, right? So that's why inversely proportional. So I'm saying, focus. You know, these quick things we are doing because we want you to focus on the language of the question, right? थोड़ा दिमाग पे प्रेशर रहता है ना विद द टाइमर इज रनिंग 30 सेकंड्स, 29 सेकंड्स, 28 सेकंड्स, बिकॉज दिस प्रेशर इज ऑल्सो देर इन द एग्जाम द क्लॉक इज रनिंग ओ माय गॉड आई एम लूजिंग टाइम लूजिंग टाइम सो दैट्स वाई हैंडल दिस प्रेशर इन अ हेल्दी वे राइट जस्ट थिंक फाइन हाँ यस सो फोकस है ना डोंट वरी सो आंसर इज टू इज टू वन फाइन ठीक है ओ नाइस योगी Currently, the leader boss says Rohit is fastest. Next is Charvi, Kashif, Kushagar, Gayatri, Dhruv, Vishard, Varsha, Bhagya, and Pratyush. All right. So this is only ten people, right? I can see a lot of you are also there. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. This is also happening, right? 
Sakshi, I sorry, I might have missed your question. Uh, right? Nice, nice. So, 21st, 24th, huh? It's okay. See, it's a very, it's a good session. Oh, it's okay, Disha. Bye-bye, take care. So, yes. Only five questions are done. We have 24, 25 more questions, you know? Step up, you know? Don't worry about the rank. Step up. Come on, think, think. You know, handle that pressure of the timer. Come on, let's start. Next phase, phase two, question number six. Let's start. <laughs> yeah, that's true actually. Uh, the Tromilly Wala thing. <laughs> I've, I've heard this many times. Question number six. Let's see. I mean, actually there is, there are sessions on this. And don't worry, by the end, till the end of this video, I'll, I'll tell you which sessions exactly I'm saying. Nice, very good, Sri Raksha. Yes, Deepu, true. This is CBC syllabus. So this question is, we have done such a question, I mean, in subjective form previously. Come on. It's an easy question. And by the way, people who are not able to see current, it is going, you know, top. Nice, majority wins. Yeah, yeah, Kushagra, I know. I told you, we have done a similar question in subjective form before. Yes. So, it says A equals B and that is greater than C equals D, right? Why is it? It was a simple thing, na? Current carrying wire, A and B, they are on the same circle. And magnetic field lines are in concentric circles. So, as you go far away from the current carrying wire, the magnetic strength decreases, right? The magnetic field strength decreases. Means, a or B, they are at equal distance from wire, same. But more than C and D, because C and D are far. Okay? Yeah, yeah, you were confident. Nice. The time goes so fast. So, A equals B, C equals D, because they are at the same distance. But A and B are closer than C and D, and that's why they are, they are more, right? CBSC. CBSC and concepts are of ICSC also. See, these are common things. Don't worry. Basic basics are there today. Correct, Nikesh. All right. Let's move. Next question. Your rapid fire 2.0. Yeah, that's true. I'm good. I'm good, Chandrakant. And actually, physics, Kana, I'll tell you, there are a lot of practice sessions. Uh, one shots, and we have done previous year questions, especially you go through that session. That is important. So question number seven, go on. <laughs> Ashida. So yes, on your screen, question number seven, a given wire of resistivity rho is cut into two halves of equal lengths. Mind it. The reason I'm slowing it down over there. Resistivity of each part will be equal to. You are getting 30 seconds only. Don't worry, this is fast. Disha, is question about that, man. Just give me one question. Okay. This was a little unexpected, yeah. I mean, majority won, but still. Oh, misclick to way, yeah. But still, but still. It's not resistance. It is resistivity. What is asked? Resistivity is asked. Does it depend on dimensions? It does not. So, what are you doing? Yes, you know, resistivity R equals, what is R? R is resistance equals rho L upon A. That rho is resistivity, you know, rho, rho depends on what? Only material and temperature. If temperature is same and material is same, whatever you do, resistivity will not change. No, don't think and don't just transform the formula that rho equals A R upon L. Don't do that. Resistivity is an intrinsic property, right? It, uh, it is independent of dimensions. Correct. Deepu's slavers bata hai na, CBSC, ICC, it's common, right? So, these concepts are common in, in all the boards. Yes. Alright. So, this confidence thing, I'm saying, uh, 
at this time it's very important that you believe that you are you have everything right previous year questions go try karo ek bar dobara se don't don't worry about new concepts and everything you have everything in your head it's just relax first of all right panic se kabhi acha nahi hua kisi ka so don't worry yes Yeah, yeah, I know, guys. I know. This time, it's it's that time. You know, the the anxiety comes in. So don't let the anxiety trouble you, man. Come on. Question number eight. On your screen. Nice, Ali Murli. Very good. Which of the following increases the strength of the magnetic field due to a solenoid? It's an easy question. right so right now whatever you have done the things you have marked you will do it again the questions you have marked the concept you have seen that i want to focus on this once again focus on those things only you know you have everything agri ma no 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 resistivity it's a it's a property right the value which says this material at this temperature will have this resistance of 1 meter length and 1 meter square area that's the definition hai na but it's a property once you have chosen the material resistivity is fixed now if you don't change the temperature nice these are so easy yaar ye sahil so these are meant for revision small small concepts aate hain yes yes and if you think something is missing hai na khud ko realize karana hai You have to realize yourself. Oh, this concept, I'm not very sure. Fine. All right. All of the above. True. The strength of a magnetic field due to a current carrying solenoid can be increased by how? See, number of turns, right? Current and in, in inserting a soft iron rod. Simple. Yes. Sahil numericals be hain. There are numericals in this. So it's a thirty question thing. There are conceptual and numericals both. Don't worry. Ha. Yes. All the given options are correct. So electromagnet, uh, Prince. When we say electromagnet, na, we normally talk about the solid. When the uh, soft iron rod is there, solenoid. It's the coil also is a solenoid, है ना? So that's why inserting the rod makes it stronger. And then we say it's electro electromagnet now. Electromagnet क्या है ना? भाई केवल coil रहेगा. It won't be sturdy. Electromagnet should You know, attract. Let's say a car. The car is heavy, and I should have strength. The rod gives it strength also. Yes. Question number ninth. Come on. Definition of resistivity. Oh, two people are asking. All right. Question number ninth on your screen. And resistivity is what? It is the resistance of unit length of wire of unit area. That is the proper definition. Right. the permanent magnet you have seen all those magnets no neodymium is a material which is uh, magnetite and all these materials yes yeah yeah surya come on guys help me out to go faster oh iq yeah all right all right sorry don't worry we'll do it we'll do it come on Even a wire resistance one ohm is stretched to double its length. What will be its new resistance? So it's a numerical. You are asking for numerical, huh? The resistance is one ohm is stretched to double its length. Mind it. It's a good question, and I I have a feeling that I'll get few wrong answers. I mean, I, I let's see. I don't want to basically assume things which are which I don't want to. Yes, Akshi. But that is, if you want to define na, the one which I said, ooh, what guys, yar. This is what I was thinking. I was, I was hoping that. Bad Severt Law, Abhijit, it's coming in class eleventh. See, it's okay. You're not upon four pi, you know, I D L cross R upon R square, yeah, unit unit R vector. So that that will come. Hold on for now. Yes. Why? Why is this question wrong? Given that R equals rho L upon A and that is one ohm, fine. After stretching, so what is what is the concept, right? Come on, what is the concept? You have stretched a wire, 
to double its length. Now, when you stretch a wire, then what happens? The volume is still constant. No, the amount of material, the volume of the material is still constant. Means area is changing. So, the language of the question is telling you everything, right? Correct? Yes. Length is twice now. Now, volume is what? Area multiplied by length. So, in both the times, A multiplied by L is constant. So, that's why. A dash is A by 2. The new area is half. Yes, Raghavan, you're right. Analyze. You think, you make some mistake and you analyze. Okay. This is where I made a mistake. I just hurried. I'll be chill. I'll be calm. Hey, nah? Yeah, yeah. Correct. A by 2. Now, once you have realized that area is also half, then you can do it. Rho L dash upon A dash. So, L by 2 upon A by 2. Sorry, 2L upon A by 2. Simple, hey, nah? So, that's why you will get 4 ohms. Take. Yeah. Karthik, wire ko stretch kiya gaya hai. So, mind it. The language of question is telling you, it is stretched to double its length. If the question had also added, keeping the area constant, then it's fine, only length is done. But here it is stretched, hai na? So, stretched means kya hota hai? Wire itna tha, now you have stretched it. But material volume the same hai na? That's why area will decrease. Take, fine. Alright. Okay. Next question guys, come on. Yes, IQO, that's the intent. Okay, question number 10, guys. Come on, come on. Yogi, you will meet good sirs. Manal sir, Anushri ma'am, and all these people are there. Don't worry. We all just sit together in the office. Don't worry. We, I know. You are, you are in safe hands. Right, come on. In which of the given cases will there be a repulsion between a magnet and a current carrying coil given that? Now, this is an important statement. Side A of coil is towards you. So, when you look at this one loop, understand, wherever there is A, that side is towards you. Hai na? So, don't be confused with this. Yeah, Disha, just hold on there. I'm saying it, don't panic. Uh, if you are panicking, na, it, this is not a good thing. You are doing good. Relax, take take rest, and do practice. But then just don't panic again and again. Okay? Nice. A lot of people got this correct. Very good. So what did you use? You just have to know which side is north pole of, of, a, of this one loop and which side is south pole. Hai na? Abhijit, this was the first time. Na? And term one just started in a hurry, then term two. So don't worry. We'll think, we'll do, we are doing this. And NTSC, we have done some uh, videos also. How to prepare and what to prepare. Don't worry. We'll, we'll deal with this. Nice. Yes. Case 1. Direction of current in the face of the coil facing magnet is in anti-clockwise. See, in the case 1, A is towards you. So, the current is going like this. Alright. So, from this side, anti-clockwise. From this side, clockwise. So, north is facing north. Repulsion, fine. Second case. A is, A is like this, right? Now, if it is like this, oh, this is clockwise. Oh, this is anti-clockwise. So, this side it is clockwise, no. So, south is facing south. Repulsion again, hai na? Nice. Educational repository. That's true. Code is 4286373. Achha, guys, can someone uh, put the code in the chat? If someone asks, hai na? Just help me out over there. Yeah, yeah. Thoda sa imagine karna padta. In this question, you have to imagine a little bit, hai na? Which side is it? So, I have to look from this side, anti-clockwise, north, oh, clockwise, south, simple, hai na? So, you can do this in the exam hall, this and this, don't worry about that, tick. So, that's why I'm saying, A is towards you, in the first case, it is like this. If you take a look from here, anti-clockwise, so north is facing north, fine. Second case, it is like this, the A is towards you, na? Clockwise, clockwise is south, right? So, that's why, south is facing south, clock face rule, huh? Cross section area is, if I take this pen and cut it from between, that circular thing, that is the cross section area. Okay? Okay? Clear? Yes. Yes, Raghavan, correct. Thank you, thank you, Creative Corner. 
So guys, Creative Corner has given the code in the chat. If someone has missed the code, please. All right, I can see Rohit is still on top. Then Gayatri, Kushagr, Richie, Kashif, Dhruvi, Rishu, Visharad, Varsha. <laughs> I won't say my name to you. <laughs> nice. <laughs> All right. Cool. Nice, Chandrakan. Good. Menti code. Uh, creative person had given there four two eight six three seven four three. Hena. Nice. Very good. Very good. And don't worry. Don't worry. Some people jumped up. Some people just got a little slide down. It's okay. Don't worry. Ten questions are done. This is. Question number eleventh on your screen, guys. Come on. Thank you, Creative Corner. Guys, Creative Corner is helping me out a lot over there. Giving the giving the code. Trijal is also giving the code. So take the code from there, na? Right? Don't worry. Nice educational repository. You are also helping me a lot. Thank you. Question number eleven on your screen now. What is the minimum resistance that can be made using six resistors each of six ohm? Now this is a very simple question. Apart from misclicks ones, I don't want wrong answers. I'm telling you, na. When actually charges again intrinsic material atoms, what atoms have electrons, protons, all these are charges only, na. Yes. Okay. Easy question, na. I don't want wrong answers. I'm telling you again. All right. Okay, I think the wrong ones are misclicks, है ना? I can assume that, no? Fine. All right. In series, oh, it's okay. IQ, uh, iftar का time हो गया, it's okay. यार. Yes. In series, they add up. Means they they increase, no? In parallel, what happens? They decrease, right? So minimum comes in parallel, maximum comes in series. That is simple. Fine. So that's why. Equivalent resistance will be minimum when all the resistors are connected in parallel. For n, I mean, if it was not six, it was n. If n equal resistors are in parallel, then equivalent resistance how much? R upon n. Now here there are six. Means six upon six. That's why it is one, right? Correct. Easy, na? Pramila, देखो. Series में add होता है. In series it adds. In parallel it it. decreases hai na so minimum resistance comes in parallel maximum comes in series you have to take 6 ohm resistances how many number six numbers and get what minimum minimum kab aayega when you connect them in parallel how to find it is if you have n resistors equal in parallel the final resistances are upon n so 6 upon 6 is 1 that's why hai na simple right theek hai easy question simple question next question Let's move towards question number twelve on your screen now. Hari Keshav, easy hai. So if you are getting confused, just hold on. Revise series in parallel. All right, we have a session on that. Oh, this one is a good question here. The reason I'm telling this to you means you have to focus on this question. ठीक है? Focus. Electric motor is shown in the figure. After half of a rotation of the armature, what will be the direction of the forces on arms A, B, and C, D? Mind it. Read the question again. After half of a rotation, see, I won't be there in the exam to help you like this, na? After half of the rotation, just focus on that yourself. Go on. All right. Three, two, one. Times up. Let's see. Okay, okay. I can see. Still, it's a it's a, a, a good majority. I would say still one not one. Okay. I'll tell you where you got confused, right? <laughs> right. Oh, Sukhjot is here now. Yes, I know where you got confused. Let me tell you what happened. See, half rotation. What is half rotation? If the coil is like this, after half rotation it will be like this. After full rotation it will be like this again. I can't do that, but yes, है ना? Half rotation will be here to here. Fine. So A B C D. Now why do we use this split ring commutator? Because every time on this side current should go inside. 
even if it turns like this right so in first half ab it was inside second it is cd again it is going inside right why so that your coil do not just oscillate like this like this like this hai na so that's why you have to maintain this thing that on left side that is ab it should be upward why it is upward which rule left hand rule na bhai what fbi force magnetic field and current so ab going inside magnetic field that side force is up so ab it is upwards cd it is downwards now one half one half is done now what is there cd is here so what has happened current is still going here no same thing is happening now cd is going upward ab is going downwards so every time it gets a force like this and that's why the coil keeps rotating like this theek hai fine yes fleming's left hand rule cool direction of current through ab and cd will get reversed after half rotation if someone ask you why do we use split ring commutator to to reverse the direction of current that's why mean actually the advantage your home right <laughs> your home just just look at your home if you take everything in series and one one device basically gets for, uh, you know gets faulty nothing will work no that's why theek hai very good yes fine so ab is downwards after half rotation and cd is upwards theek hai fine nice all right let's move towards the question number 13 and this was a good question guys see in exam no there is a possibility that the second diagram will not be given so you have to imagine from your side ke bhai coil ab aise ho gaya the coil has turned now hai na brushes give contact if this is your commutator that is a brush without brush how will you close the circuit so brush basically stays there commutator slips and the next one comes tick it gives contact it closes the circuit nice ranjit yeah 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 so raghavan don't cram uh, or don't uh, basically just take this past with you ke in all diagrams it is like this in my previous diagram i i had changed the battery's connection and that was also tricky i saw a lot of you made mistakes over there theek hai so always focus ke battery ka direction kya hai magnet pe north south kahan le hoga right what is the direction of battery and where is north and south of the magnet theek hai so this was an important question that's why i'm saying focus question number 13 guys come on shakti armature the coil itself right and inside it's a multiple coil then we say armature this coil thing is armature only it rotates na trijal use all the uh, formula sheets mind map and cheat sheets all right next question find the equivalent resistance between a and b in the given circuit diagram not an difficult question i mean not a difficult question but a slightly good question i would say oh nice abhishek you are way ahead of your class all right yes come on all right i can see majority is correct for board yes ncrt has all the concepts which are important right so don't worry yeah that's good enough in boards especially in cbse boards question do not come above ncrt level be sure of that fine so what happened here <laughs> no nee, no nee, yogi it's not there Yes. Yeah, Hari Murli, correct. Oh, so in this question, the problem was how the diagram was arranged. That's only was the problem, right? So if you take a look, see, there is point A, there is point B. If you and there are two roads from A to B. The first road you will see R and R again, and then you reach at point B. Focus, na? What I'm telling you, focus, focus. ए से बी पे जाने के लिए दो रास्ते हैं देर आर टू रोड द फर्स्ट रोड हैज टू रेजिस्टेंसिस इज बिटवीन द सेकेंड रोड हैज वन रेजिस्टेंस इन बिटवीन सो वॉट इज दिस दिस इज नथिंग बट दिस डायग्राम नो है ना सेम थिंग नो तो दैट्स वाई ए टू बी 
there are two wires in parallel first one has two resistance second one has one resistance simple so two r and r in parallel simple 2r multiplied by r upon 2r plus r so this is what 2 by 3r simple right are yatish don't worry yatish take a deep breath relax and then go for the next question hai na easy hai na ha uh, hello niti nice disha oh disha you are still here i thought you left relax you got this just just hold on say i know everything if i made a mistake you should know why you made a mistake then fine theek hai thank you bharti <laughs> aditya are meri kripa se nahi tumko aata hai isliye sahi ho gaya nice all right all right so easy question hai na this question the only reason i give you because you have asked me a lot of times sir resistance based question chahiye isse bhari question mushkil hi aayega hai na so just focus right very good तुक्का अरे तुक्का ऐसे तुक्का नहीं मारना यार या परवेश प्लीज आस्क ठीक है क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टीन राइट यस यस चेतना यू आर करेक्ट सो क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टीन ऑन योर स्क्रीन नाउ रमेश If you are getting wrong answers, don't worry. I'm saying, you know, don't worry. First of all, just realize once this session ends, no, I'm pretty sure it's the timer which is which is fiddling with you. So don't worry about that. वो timer है जो हमको pressure देता है. Otherwise, you know things. I'm just saying again, try things, practice at your home using a timer. In one hour, my plan is to finish, let's say, ten questions. Let's say ten questions. I'll finish ten questions, you know. Come on, this question. Majority is correct, but still, seventy-three people gave third option also. Huh? Why? Current carrying circular coil is placed on a horizontal plane as shown below. Magnetic field due to coil will be into the plane at into the plane. Do you know this? Same thing. Right hand thumb rule only. Right. Simple. Direction of magnetic field due to a current carrying circular coil is by applying right hand thumb rule. so how do you apply i'll tell you direction of magnetic field is into the plane at point b now see your coil is like this focus hai na just see what i'm doing your coil is like this hai na sahi baat hai so it's like a combination of many straight wires no so here and current is in this direction so current here my hand goes like this 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 so at a and b point just first of all mark the current oh current is here like this hai na current is like this so thumb and it says b to a so that's why out of the plane at b b se bahar aa raha hai aur a se andar ja raha hai theek hai right hand ye are left hand kar liya kya no left hand right hand right hand theek hai left hand is only for fbi है ना लेफ्ट हैंड इज ओनली यूज व्हेन यू वांट टू यूज एफबीआई राइट हैंड कब करोगे इफ यू वांट टू फाइंड मैग्नेटिक फील्ड और मोशन एमआईबी राइट टिक इजी राइट नाइस ऑल राइट क्वेश्चन नंबर 15 कम ऑन नाइस यदि इस बैलेंस करना पड़ता है ना सो इफ यू नो वेल एंड गुड अगला क्वेश्चन अगेन अ सर्किट बेस्ड क्वेश्चन फाइन Calculate the total current through the given circuit. Now this is a little time-taking question, but still I have given you one minute. M I B motion वाला पार्थ, है ना? M I B magnetic field, current, motion. So this is induced current. Motion होता है कंडक्टर का मैग्नेटिक फील्ड में तो where do you get the induced current? That. Devansh, hello. Definitely Minakshi. That's why I'm here. राइट पोल परवेज इट्स अ मेंटी ना हैव यू लॉक डाउन टू मेंटी ऑन द मेंटी डॉट कॉम यू हैव पुट द कोड देर इज एवरीथिंग इट्स गोइंग ऑन और राइट आंसर आर कमिंग नाइस सिंपल सर्किट सॉल्विंग सिंप्लीफाइंग रेजिस्टेंस क्वेश्चन गाइस ठीक है आसान क्वेश्चन है यस वन टाइम्स अप लेट मी सी वाह बहुत बढ़िया 
Nice. Majority got the correct answer. Simplifying the question, na? Kya hai? See, these three and three, these two are in series. So just simplify it like this. Three plus three is six. Six and three are in parallel. Then two in parallel. So one by six plus one by three plus one by two. Simple. Then you will get one ohm, hai na? So that's why five point one is five ampere. Simple tha. Yes. Correct. Ha. <laughs> yes. Now in this question, just one more thing. It was said total current, है ना? Whenever total current is asked, you have to find the equivalent resistance, voltage upon equivalent resistance, है ना? Don't be confused. All right. Kushagar came on top now. Very good. Kushagar, Gayatri, Richie, Apar, Kashif, Dhruvi, Rishu, Varsha, Bhagya, Rohit. Nice. Leaderboard. <laughs> Swamujit, don't worry. आपको मजा आएगा eleventh में. Yes. Ravi, it's there. The the when I think no animation is not required, we'll go for menti. If animation is required to explain you something, we'll go for thing. Right? Thank you, Aditya. Means a lot. It's okay, Vaishnavi. We don't. <laughs> All right. Kal Kalyani, you get the notification whenever the session happens. Ah, uh, Bengali. I have no idea. <laughs> Sorry. All right. Question number sixteen, guys. Focus, focus. Don't worry if you are getting wrong answers. I'm just saying, take this in a healthy way and go home and practice. See, the the only reason we are doing this is to, you know, basically make all these concepts move in front of your eyes. सब सामने से गुजर जाएगा. इसके लिए बस, ठीक है? Yes. Time to do it. Yeah, see, timer is running. Don't worry, I'm doing it fast only. Yes, sir. Force on a current carrying conductor kept in a magnetic field maximum the conductor is placed. This one is simple. This one is very simple. Yes, yes. Come on. Wow. So this one is like very simple, huh? Force on a current carrying conductor kept in a magnetic field maximum when it is placed perpendicular. So if you get confused any time, just see your fingers. In any rule, you always make this. This is 90. This is 90. This is also 90, right? So it's 90, है ना? Menti code 4286374. Yes, correct. <laughs> All right. This was a very easy question. Yeah, e easiest question of today. That's true. Cool. Next question, question number seventeen, guys. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, for max perpendicular, for zero parallel. Concentrate in studies. Time लेके पढ़ना, right? And then when the time finish, take break and then study again. लेकिन बीच में मोबाइल मत चलाना यार, please. <laughs> Anjita, don't worry. I'll keep coming to here to meet you guys. Yes, calculate the amount of heat dissipated in ten seconds by a forty volt, hundred volt bulb when connected, as shown in the figure. Focus, है ना? All right. Look at the figure, guys. Don't make a mistake, which I'm thinking you might make. Please focus. देखो हर question में we have the team who made these questions. They have laid some traps for you. My only fear is don't fall in those traps. अरे मोबाइल मोबाइल में कुछ और मत चलाना पढ़ने के लिए ठीक है. Oh, ये क्या हुआ? अरे ये क्या हुआ भाई? 200 जूल 108 people, 400 जूल 96 people. 100 joule, the correct answer only 13 people. What? So, okay. People who are asking to go fast, hold on a second. Hai na? Just wait. What is the problem? Let me tell you. Amount of heat dissipated in 10 seconds by a 40 volt, 100 volt bulb when connected as shown in the figure. Figure mein kitna voltage diya tha usko? How much voltage was given? Uh, Ami J Tomar, see. <laughs> see, that is the only thing I know. Yes, come on. What was the voltage given to you? 50 volts, na? 
not 100 volts mind it yes rated power was 40 watt at 100 volt time t is 10 seconds so power is v square upon r simple now you have to find the resistance first find the resistance right? because voltage might change but the resistance of device will remain the same no so with the power rating find the resistance it will be 100 multiplied by 100 upon 40 watts right that is 250 ohms <laughs> yes okay next look at the diagram now diagram what is what is the diagram showing you there is 50 volts over here not 100 volts that is the thing that's what i was saying focus on the diagram clue hai wahan pe he dissipated h equals v square upon r into t right v kitna diya hai 50 volt now so 50 into 50 upon 250 multiplied by 10 that is 100 theek yes oh it's okay dashwant so that's why hai na P into T, Aslam, you could have done it very easily if it was given 100 volts. But here it was not 100 volts, it was 50 volts. So that's why you have to go all this. Okay? No, no, Hemant, it was 100, 100 joule. 50 volt diya hai na, that's why. Fine. Got this. Okay. This was a very important question I'm telling you. Please, please, just understand this. Jumana, haan, time can be a thing, I understand. Calculation thoda jaldi fast ho sakta hai. Haan, Chandrakan, I understand that. But I am doing this session just to make you realize that confidence itna jaldi lose nahi karna. Bahut precious cheez hai. It's a very precious thing, your confidence. Don't lose it so easily, hai na? Don't worry. Alright, question number 18 guys, come on. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Hello, Anishka. All right, this question we have done. A sort of question in our previous sessions we have done. Menti code is 4286473. Which of the following is the correct order of strength? Mind it. Ye less than, greater than, just focus on less than, greater than, all right? Correct order of strength, magnetic field due to a solenoid coil of points 1, 2, 3, 4 as shown in the figure. We have done such a question, I'm telling you. Ooh. What happened here? Are? What happened? One is out of the solenoid. Right? Two and three are inside the solenoid. Four is at the edge. Anna? At the edge. Now, I am telling you, some of you got it correct because you thought four would be more than two and three. And the reason is, Sir, bar magnet we used to say that on the edge, on the poles, it is highest. Solenoid me kyu nahi? It is similar to bar magnet. Lekin understand this. Bar magnet ke andar ghusne ka chance nahi hota na? In solenoid you have a chance. It's a hollow space. So that is the strength. That is the, it's the strongest. But, bahar. Next is 4 then. Right? So highest is 2 and 3. Next is 4 and then it is 1. So, you have to go for increasing order. So least is 1, then 4, then 2 and 3. Simple. Yes. Ascending. Yes. Correct order of strength. I told you. Less than again. Me thoda focus karna. Chandrakant. Aise lose nahi karna yaar ho. Come on. Haan. Raghavan. I just explained it. Edge pe. You got this misconception from bar magnet. Solenoid me. Inside it is uniform. Hai na? It is uniform inside a current carrying solenoid. The degree of closeness of magnetic field it, uh, decreases as the distance from solenoid increases. Tick. Fine. Why 4 is less than 2 and 3? You are telling me. See, inside a solenoid, na, it is the strongest. Beach mein hai. Beach mein there is hollow space. So that's why solenoid has basically time. It You can go between. You are thinking of bar magnet. Okay, sir, why do we say it is the strongest as poles? In between, there is no space to go. Na. That's why we say. Okay? Yes? Haan, so, the only point of confusion was 4 and 2 and 3. So, inside, it is maximum. It is uniform. Alright? And then 4 is the next one. Take. Are nahi kavya. Don't worry. Yaar. Galat se nahi danna, dosto. Pehli bata rahu. Alright? Fine. Yes. So you are. 
अरे दिशा प्रीवियस ईयर क्वेश्चन आराम से बैठ के करना बस यस करेक्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर 19 ऑन योर स्क्रीन नाउ कमान कमान अरे किसी को इग्नोर नहीं किया जा रहा है आई माइट हैव मिस्ड योर क्वेश्चन राइट यस द हीटिंग एलिमेंट ऑफ एन इलेक्ट्रिक हीटर इज मेड ऑफ अच्छा ये तो इजी है ना कमान टेल मी सिंपल मेमोरी बेस्ड क्वेश्चन यस कार्टून वर्ल्ड हिंदी इंग्लिश चीज समझ में आनी चाहिए वो जरूरी है इंग्लिश बस इसलिए होता है बिकॉज आई वॉन्ट यू टू पुश लिटिल बिट फॉर दैट हा मीनाक्षी द आंसर इज कंडक्टर्स राइट दे आर गुड कंडक्टर्स यू डोंट वॉन्ट टू लूज हीट इन ट्रांसमिशन वहां पर ही हीट लूज कर गया तो आगे क्या देंगे बट हे आर यू वॉन्ट हीट दैट्स वाई है ना Yes, simple. Nichrome is the correct answer. Why? High resistivity, high melting point does not oxidize at high temperature. Simple, है ना? This was the thing. Nichrome. It's very easy. All right. Nice. Very good. Question number twenty on your correct question. You are right. <laughs> Chandrakant, ha? You remember? It's just you are thinking. You don't remember. Don't worry. Numerical me I see here. You are taking time, and here time is less. So. वर्क ऑन दैट पार्ट थोड़ा बहुत अ मैग्नेट रिपीटेडली मूव स्लोली अप माही लास्ट क्वेश्चन वॉज नाइक्रोम बिकॉज इट हैज हाई रेजिस्टिविटी हाई मेल्टिंग पॉइंट इट डज नॉट ऑक्सीडाइज राइट वेन यू हीट इट इन प्रेजेंस ऑफ ऑक्सीजन अ मैग्नेट रिपीटेडली मूव स्लोली अप एंड डाउन एज गिवन इन द फिगर अच्छा पीपल हु आर नॉट एबल टू सी दिस फिगर वेरी क्लियरली यहां कुछ नहीं है इन द बॉटम देर इज अ सोलिनॉइड बेसिकली यू कैन से आई मीन It's a coil and a magnet is going up and down. Nice, correct answer. Manant, it's Saurabh. All right, easy. You know this, yar. Electromagnetic induction. When the magnet is moved repeatedly up and down, changing current will be induced in the coil in opposite direction. Magnet will go in, come out, go in, come out. And what is happening? Every time there is a current induced, but the direction is changing. No, it is going in. One direction, coming out another direction. Simple, है ना? Yes. Yes, it will show both directions. It will oscillate basically, right? So hence the galvanometer will show constantly changing deflections towards both the sides. That is the thing. Concept is, concept is electromagnetic induction. The magnet and coil, there should be a relative motion between them. या तो ऐसा हो, या ऐसा हो, या फिर ऐसा हो. But there should be relative means अगर दोनों move करेंगे with equal velocity this is a question I'm telling you right now if a question comes a magnet and coil is moving with velocity of let's say फाइव meter per second will there be a, a current induced no why relative motion तो zero है that's why ठीक fine yes so that's why the thing which I just told you it's kind of a question right just remember it all right. हा आई नो नाही सरी मुरली या येस इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड इन सिंप इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड टू इलेवेंथ में ना डोंट वरी अबाउट दिस राइट नाउ राइट गायत्री कुशाग्र ओ नाइस कुशाग्र यू आर इन सेकेंड नाउ अपार काशिफ रोहित रिचिक Charvis back, Bhagya, Varsha, Dhruvi. All right, guys. I can see a lot of fluctuating names in this top ten, and we have just been with twenty questions. We have ten more questions, right? Different velocities will happen. Then yes, you will have induced current. All right. Question number twenty-one. Nice. It's okay, Raghavan. Don't worry. You will fine. Question number twenty-one on your screen now. If the current through a resistor is doubled, the heat dissipated by it for the same time interval. It's an easy question, right? It's an easy question, guys. Electric generator opposite electric energy to mechanical energy, right? Basically, functions in the just opposite manner of motor. 
yes gautam electric field वो एक तरह से वो एरिया है जहां पर आप चार्ज की वजह से फोर्स महसूस कर सकते हो सिमिलर टू मैग्नेटिक फील्ड है ना इन वेरी सिंपल वर्ड्स यस कमान कमान डोंट गेट दिस क्वेश्चन रॉन्ग कमान ओके आई कैन सी देर हैज बीन सम कंफ्यूजन इन डबल्ड एंड क्वाड्रुपल्ड क्या यूज किया नाइस नाइस अरे यू न्यू दैट हीट डिसिपेटेड वेन यू से हीट डिसिपेटेड आई वॉन्ट यू टू थिंक ऑफ जूल्स लॉ कमान जूल्स लॉ ऑफ हीटिंग आई स्क्वेयर आर टी है ना यू आर सेंग वी इन टू आई इफ यू चेंज द रेजिस्टेंस द वोल्टेज ड्रॉप एंड करंट बोथ आर चेंजिंग नो सो दैट्स वाई है ना करेक्ट वन Quadrupled, I is two I now. Heat is I square R T, correct? Right? If current through resistor is doubled, क्या double किया? Current. कौन सा formula use करें? जिसमें केवल current हो, right? Current double करने से क्या resistance change होगा? नहीं होगा. Resistance उतना रहेगा ना? है ना? So that's why use a formula in which current is the what do I say is the hero? Which formula is this? I square R T. So use that. ठीक? So I square R T H equals two I and Square of two is four. Tick. That's why this is four times of the previous one. Option A and option D. What was op option A? So, tick. It was four. What was option D? What was option D? Shakuntala, just tell me what was option D because. I don't remember here. And if I go back, you'll go to the question again. Quartered, acha. Quartered means one by four, right? Yes. Ha. Quarter means a quarter. What is a quarter? One by four. Quadrupled means four times. So this is important. Ha. It's a good question here. Thank you, whoever asked this questions. uh thanks for asking this question i understand this english thing can be confusing quartered matlab 1/4 quadrupled means four times tick all right good good question thanks so simple question easy question done yes question number 22 menti quiz for class 9th kabhi don't worry we'll have it for class 9th also because we are explaining concepts to the class 9 students and that's why menti explanation may it it's a hindrance but ha practice and questions will go for it yes question number 22 on your screen yes come on <laughs> all right 25 24 seconds are come on come on guys which of the following is not used in commercial electric motors Large number of turns of conducting wire, permanent magnet, coil wound on soft iron core or electromagnet. All right, let's see how many get this correct. Yes, nice. This is fine. Majority is correct in this time. Commercial electric motor uses what? Electromagnets, large number of turns in the coil, and armature, right? That's true, right? So they don't use permanent magnets because they want to use strong magnets. And generally, electromagnets are stronger than permanent magnets, right? We don't use permanent magnets. Correct. Nice. That's true. Text. All right. Next question. Come on. It was easy. Yeah, I know. Very good, Dashwant. Question number twenty-three. Minakshi, electromagnetic question. How does it work? Current, right? If you increase the current. Yes, yes. Are you talking about failed physics? 
so all topics are there i have been i have been talk to class 10th students na right? for you i would say go to the previous videos guys come on 10 seconds left rate of heat dissipation of a toaster that draws 5 ampere current when connected to a 220 volt supply for 5 seconds i know time might be an issue in this but still i can see i can see what what dragged you back time right yes lakshya time dragged you back is it this time was it was less i know galti se mistake ho gaya okay yes the problem is what is asked from you rate of heat dissipation not the heat dissipation to jhool to hoga hi nahi it will be what they are asking you power first of all ठीक राइट वॉट इज आस्ट रेट ऑफ हीट डिसिपेशन सो दिस वर्ड इज द होल क्लू इन दिस क्वेश्चन हीट डिसिपेशन यू विल थिंक द आंसर वुड बी जूल सो जूल्स आर ऑल गॉन इट शुड बी पावर इट कुड बी आइदर ऑप्शन बी और ऑप्शन सी एंड सिंपल राइट दैट्स वाई राइट वॉइस इज नॉट गुड चेक योर इयरफोन्स आई थिंक दे आर चीप कमान I is 5 amperes, right? Operating voltage V equals 220 volts. Time T is 5 seconds, right? Rate of heat dissipation. You are thinking of power first of all, right? Power is V into I. Voltage into current, simple, right? Yes, correct. It will be power. So 220 volts into 5 amperes, right? What is there? 1.1 kilowatt. Yes, correct. Yes, you have to find power now. That is important. Electrical, uh, electrical, numerical, simple. Just focus on what is given to you and what is being asked. Simple, correct. Yeah, language gets tricky. So that's why these questions we are presenting in front of you because these kind of phrases and language will basically bring you down. So focus. Rate of heat dissipation, power. Heat dissipation is heat. Simple, है ना? All right, let's move. Next question, question number twenty-four on your screen now. In which of the following cases will the LED glow? Now, in this question, if you are not able to see the diagram properly, there is a magnet and there is a loop and there is an LED on the loop. Tick, है ना? Yes. Miss Clit, I understand. And there are three things given to you. When the magnet is moved towards the coil, when coil is moved towards the magnet, when both the coil. We just discussed this question. I just uh, explained this question to you, right? Nice. I know you got this correct. Majority wins in this question, right? Why? Because. there should be relative motion when the coil and magnet are stationary current will not be induced and hence led will not glow if there is a relative motion means current will come right yes that's why right ha apart it's a it's a very good statement yes so here i understand led means the question was trying to give you a bulb so this knowledge in this level you might not have and that's why the led was kept but in it's a what a filament bulb for you no so that's why don't think it's a diode only one direction current is possible think of it as a filament bulb so don't go into these technicalities at this level but yes it's a good catch very good yes in stationary current will not be induced so that is Correct. Manatya, yeah, with a small bulb, it's possible. Question twenty-five of thirty. Come on, this is the twenty-fifth question. Electric fan consumes eighty watt when connected to two twenty volt supply. How much power will it consume when connected to a hundred and ten volt supply? Now this is a little time-taking question. Focus. Yes. Correct. 
कमान 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 इलेक्ट्रिक फैन कंज्यूम्स एटी वॉट वेन कनेक्टेड टू टू ट्वेंटी वोल्ट सप्लाई सो वॉट इज गिवन टू यू पावर वेन इट इज कनेक्टेड टू टू ट्वेंटी वोल्ट सप्लाई हाउ मच विल इट कंज्यूम वेन हंड्रेड टेन वोल्ट सप्लाई इज गिवन टू यू नाउ देर इज अ क्विक वे टू डू दिस क्वेश्चन एंड देर इज अ लेंदी वे टू डू दिस क्वेश्चन आई विल शो यू आई मीन आई एक्सप्लेन यू बोथ आई जस्ट वॉन्ट टू सी हाउ मेन इफ यू अडॉप्ट विच मेथड थिंक एंड इट्स अ वेरी यू नो वॉट डू आई से बोर्ड ओरिएंटेड क्वेश्चन इट कैन कम Yes. All right. I can see A, B, A. Oof. Majority is wrong. Was time the problem? Was time the problem? Huh? Yeah. Kushagra. Huh? It's a, it's a quick way, but you might falter somewhere. That's why I'm telling you. What happened? V one was two twenty volts and power one was eighty volts. Fine. V two was hundred and ten volts. Power two something. You have to find. ठीक है सो दिस इज अ लेंदी वे बिकॉज यू आर गोइंग इन टू कैलकुलेशन पावर कंज्यूम पी इक्वल वी स्क्वायर अपॉन आर इट्स अ सेम डिवाइस वॉट चेंज द सप्लाई वोल्टेज चेंज मीन्स रेजिस्टेंस विल रिमेन द सेम है ना सो पी इक्वल वी स्क्वायर अपॉन आर आर इक्वल वी स्क्वायर अपॉन पी यू कैन फाइंड रेजिस्टेंस एंड देन यूज द रेजिस्टेंस टू फाइंड द न्यू पावर बट अनदर वे इज रेजिस्टेंस इज सेम ना मीन्स वॉट कैन यू डू v square upon p1 equals equals v2 square upon p2 right you can do that hai na potential difference how much voltage is dropped right how much how much voltage is dropped on that right p equals vi is not y because current is given to you no choose a value see if device is same if you change the voltage current will also change na what remains same the resistance of this device remains same fine so that's why i'm saying the quicker way is v1 square upon p1 equals v2 square upon p2 the reason i'm saying this is a quick method because look at the values 220 220 110 110 it will cut jayega na kya aayega 110 is will say twice it will cut it and say two and this is two again so that's why second method second method mein kya karna hai na dekho 220 square upon 80 equals Equals 110 square upon P2. 220 square upon 80 equals 110 square upon P2. इससे P2 आ जाएगा. हमने क्यों किया ये? हमने क्या equate किया? What did we equate? Resistance. Because resistance in both the cases is same, right? Correct. When to use which formula? This is the is the biggest problem you face in electricity, guys. Go and just uh, after this session, before whenever you are practicing, I would say go and take a look at the question session of electricity. They are good, and you will understand which which formula to use at which place. Voltage ka karein, I square R karein, ya V square upon R karein, ya V I karein. So that's why, right? ठीक है? Easy. Choose the second method. That is important. All right. Yes. अरे राघवन इट्स ओके वी हैव गायत्री अपार काशिफ रोहित ध्रुवी कुशाग्र चारवी ऋचिक वर्षा ऋषु या इट्स ओके गाइज द रीज आई एम टेलिंग यू अगैन रीजन इज नॉट टू गिव यू रैंकिंग ओवर हेयर द रीजन इज ऑल दीज स्मॉल स्मॉल कॉन्सेप्ट शुड मूव इन फ्रंट ऑफ योर आईज सो दैट यू नो वॉट टू वर्क अपॉन टाइम है ये जो टाइम मिला है ना इसमें हम बोर होने लगते हैं यू यू फॉरगेट टू प्रैक्टिस इन दीज थिंग्स हैपन सो दिस इज अ रिविजन थिंग यूज इट एज अ रिविजन ठीक है दैट्स व्हाई आई एम सेइंग दिस इज नॉट टू डिमोटिवेट गाइस कम ऑन टेक इट इन अ गुड स्पिरिट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल द टॉपिक्स व्हिच यू फील यू हैव फॉरगॉटन इन दिस सेशन वी हैव टेकन अ लुक एट द होल सब्जेक्ट द होल फिजिक्स फॉर टर्म 2 आई एम सेइंग व्हेन ऑल दिस थिंग हैपन इन फ्रंट ऑफ योर आईज जस्ट फोकस ना यार ये याद नहीं आ रहा है this thing i feel i have, I have forgotten right so after the session take some time and think okay this i'll revise tomorrow this i'll revise day after tomorrow make a plan na yes question number 26 so dashwant sample paper analysis there is a session go and in that those things uh, we have told you pr uh, properly yes a charged particle acha dekho theek hai this is again an interesting and important question we have done such a question before 
I'm saying if you make this question wrong, don't be demotivated first of all, but try to make it correct. There's a catch in this question. A particle, uh, sorry, a charged particle enters a magnetic field as shown if the direction of force acting on the particle is into the screen. Direction of force acting on the particle is into the screen. Force kaun dikhata hai? Ye. Focus. I'm giving you a hint. Manat, your comment I guess you only half. Alright. Nice. Wow. I'm, I'm actually glad. I'm really glad that majority won in this question. Yes, correct, Lavia. Nice. Proud of you guys. You made this question correct because I was afraid. I'm, I'm seeing. Yes. Yeah, yeah, Bharti. Yes. Correct, Manat. You're right. Emitter is connected in parallel, so it's a short circuit. Whole current will go through emitter. The direction of force on the particle is into the screen. Means direction of force is inside, right? Which what is inside? This. Alright. Magnetic field is here. So what are you using? FBI, right? This is force. This is magnetic field. This is current. Fine. So mag force is inside. Magnetic field here. Oh, means current is this side. Okay. Now what is current? Current, conventionally, we take it as a flow of positive charges. But it is saying charged particle is here. Positive are going there. It is the negative one, no? Right? So that's why by applying Fleming's left hand rule, direction of current will be uh, obtained as upward. As the motion of particle is in opposite direction, particle is negatively charged. Hence, correct option is electron. Yes. So text, it's a convention. Like in, uh, when this convention was sorted, till then, uh, so many rules were built upon that convention that it was very difficult to change that convention. So unhone bola, it's okay. Take care. Chalne dete. Right? Short trick for rules. See, I use FBI. You want to find the force. Okay, force. FBI. I'll call the FBI. If you want to find the motion, right? Current induced with motion, I'll call MIB. And if you want to find direction of magnetic field with current, right hand. So, left hand is only for one force. Bagi sammo to right hand hi hai na? Correct? Paz. Again, see, understand this again. Guys, everyone, I'm telling you. Force, the question is saying, is, is inside. Hai na? Force inside bold right question. Fine. So looking at the diagram, I'll say inside is force. I'll use the left hand. No. Inside is force. This side is magnetic field. And my current is in this direction. No. All right. Current is direction. Mein. Current ka direction is what? It is the direction of flow of positive charges. Okay. Conventionally, again. If positive charges ke flow se current idhar aara hai, my charge particle is here, so it is a negative particle, no? So that's why. Hai na? Sorry, Darshni. Tamil teri adi. Men in Black, I have movie dekhi diya bar. Take force under magnetic field idhar, to current idhar aana chahiye tha. Hai na? Question ulta kar raha hai. Question aapko current or magnetic field leke force nahi pooch raha hai. Current is not asking you force, giving you magnetic field and current. Sorry, the question. But the question is giving you force, giving you magnetic field and asking what particle is this? You found current here means you found positive charge here, but charge particle here is in this direction means it's an electron. Take. Fine. Oh, Kushal, maaf ki jiga. All right, come on guys. Ho gai masti, aage Yes. Question number 27. On your screen guys, come on, come on. Choose the best fuse rating for a TV with operating voltage of 110 volts and power 220 watts. Now, ye dekho, ye asan question. Hai. This is an easy question. I want this to be correct for everyone. Yeah, Vaishnavi, that's true. Don't worry, guys. See, don't be demotivated. I'm telling you again. Question galat ho raha hai means here it's it's pressure. You just have to change the way you practice. Practice with time. All right. Now, take choose number of questions. Take some time and sit for that time and give questions. All right. So do that. Nice. Majority give the correct answer. So 
psychology for this question is simple hai na it is current is what p upon v power equals voltage into current so you might ask sir why we are using this here right it was given to you like this no power rating say with the power rating and the voltage rating you can find how much current is required this device requires 2 ampere now you will put a fuse which is slightly above no if you put a 2 ampere fuse it will never work i mean the device can never work right that's why ha ah, slightly above the fuse rating must be a little bit more than the current derived using the power formula hence the best choice will be 2.2 amperes fine how much more see just get uh, i would say you can say around 10% right ha ah, yes so that's why not like double if you ask me 3.2 3.2 is to how much 1.2 is how much percentage of 2 uh 12 upon 20 means this is 10 6 about 60% 60% higher uh, current the device will not work no it will just blow correct hai na so that's why i'm telling you slightly above question mein hamesha notice karna slightly above wala question number 28 guys come on we are near to the end guys come on last three questions shashikla is almost one third If number of turns in a circular current carrying coil is doubled, what is doubled? Number of turns. Then magnetic field strength due to the coil will be. Now this is again this is one of the question we have we have already done previously. Thank you, Dolly. Yes, Alan. Questions are easy. Meant for revision. Meant for revision. If you are making a mistake, there is some problem with time because when you are practicing with pressure and time, there is a problem. focus on that all right so that's why nice majority got this correct very good very good nice i mean actually it is of a material current in each turn of circular coil has the same direction if you increase the loop what is happening you are you are basically putting one more loop which is current is in same direction at each and every point no so it is adding up so that's why if there is a circular coil having n turns the field produces n times as large hai na yes as that produced by single turn hence magnetic field strength will become twice due to the coil nice easy okay very good nice kavya Co see i'm telling you confidence is precious don't let it get loose fine question number 29th calculate the electrical energy consumed by electric fan of power 60 watt in 5 hours it's a calculation based question right fine hai na pakka bhai bilkul pakka yes so i'm saying resistivity is a property of a material इंसुलेटर्स का भी होगा कंडक्टर्स का भी होगा कंडक्टर्स का क्या होगा रेजिस्टिविटी कम होगा इंसुलेटर का ज्यादा होगा सिंपल है ना नाइस आई एम अज्यूमिंग द रॉन्ग वंस आर कैलकुलेशन मिस्टेक्स सो यू नो कैलकुलेशन मिस्टेक हो रहा है व्हेन यू आर यू आर प्रैक्टिसिंग विद दिस प्रेशर ऑफ टाइम ऋषि यस ओके कुशल All right. So, power is given to you. Time is given to you. Energy is asked. Electrical energy we answer in kilowatt hours, and that's why power into time. If you if you want to do it, what? What into time? You can also do. Miss click over here. All right. All right. So, power is sixty watts. Sixty upon thousands is point zero six multiplied by five. That is point three kilowatt hour. Simple, है ना? Easy. Very easy question. Simple calculation question. the last question for today come on hello atisha okay this is slightly complicated just look at your phone what should be the direction of motion of a conductor placed in a uniform magnetic field such that a current is induced in the conductor from b to a which rule which rule i'm don't don't uh, kilowatt kaise nikalte hain kuch nahi na What multiplied by time, right? अब वॉट किस में होना चाहिए किलो वॉट में 
तो क्या होता है अगर एक ग्राम दिया होता है किलोग्राम में करना वॉट यू डू वन अपॉइंट थाउजेंड वॉट इज गिवन टू यू कन्वर्ट टू किलो वॉट वन अपॉइंट थाउजेंड सिंपल है ना नाइस राइट हैंड एम आई बी राइट हु विल यू कॉल मैन इन ब्लैक राइट मोशन मैग्नेटिक फील्ड इंड्यूस करंट सिंपल अच्छा क्रॉस मतलब पता है ना एवरीबडी नोज वॉट हाँ अच्छा क्रॉस इज गिवन टू यू सॉरी इन टू वाओ मेजोरिटी गॉट दिस करेक्ट वेरी गुड नाइस यस राइट एंड रूल यस करेक्ट सो वॉट वॉज गिवन टू यू डायरेक्शन ऑफ मोशन ऑफ कनेक्टर प्लेज इन्फॉर्मेटिव फील्ड सच दैट करंट इज इन यूज फ्रॉम बी टू ए बी टू ए दिस इज करंट सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल जस्ट चूज योर फिंगर्स वाइजली बी टू ए करंट ऐसे मैग्नेटिक फील्ड इज इन साइड दिस इज माई मोशन अपवर्ड सिंपल है ना दैट्स हाउ यू डू राइट यस अभिषेक या आई रिमेंबर यू यस दैट्स वाई आई एम सेइंग डोंट वरी दिस इज द फाइनल लीडर बोर्ड अगेन कॉन्ग्रेचुलेशन टू पीपल हु आर देयर अदर्स डोंट बी डिमोटिवेटेड आई एम टेलिंग यू फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल राइट सो गायत्री अपार नाइस कॉन्ग्रेचुलेशन गायत्री वेरी गुड काशिफ चारवी रिचू वर्षा रोहित रिचीक कॉन्ग्रेचुलेशन यस and others again i'm saying the intent of this session is ke itne sare concepts aapke samne se niklenge so right the reason is folk just understand na what is my problem if as a student what is my problem is it time is it pressure is it concepts is it numericals what is it if it is numericals check out all those sessions in which we have done practice questions previous year papers sample papers if it is concepts then which concept choose those sessions if it is time time to khud se karo take a clock put an alarm of let's say 1 hour and choose a set of questions unko karo give yourself pressure try to solve it like that hai na that's why i'm saying don't worry you have got this in this final days just realize where am i lagging aisa nahi hai you don't have it here you have all the concepts still ye last time hai na final run don't be demotivated you have got everything and yes you will make us proud i'm pretty sure and we have got you covered don't worry about this all these things are there on youtube right but I, after this session i would say realize first of all where you are lagging hai na don't worry we'll give you notification ek bar yes do not lose confidence i'm telling you again and again guys if you lose confidence now nothing good will come out of it so that's why right rules ke liye uh, there is a session we did which was formula sheets and mind maps right there very nicely we have given you a whole pdf to usko lo us pe kuch kuch kaam karo theek hai and so don't worry don't worry next class gautam sometime sometime first realize you can put in the comment section what do you want we'll look into it but don't worry we won't leave you alone right i know you have a long exams we know you have long exams we'll see you again we just want to think what else you want right so hold on don't worry disha ye nahi hona chahiye i'm telling you right pichle koi session dekhna practice karo put yourself in time pressure that is the only thing nice thank you everyone thank you take care do not lose confidence promise me just and then all the best All right. Bye bye.